Alexander Marks with the Nevada State Education Association. Uh, switching gears a little bit from my colleague Chris, we're going to talk about the census. Um, NSCA is sitting on the Education Subcommittee Complete Count, um, and I just wanted to share the, uh, the work we're doing in the community and through uh, statewide. Uh, the importance of the U.S. Census and to the well-being of our children and the strength of our public schools cannot be overstated. Using this data, uh, federal government allocates tens of billions of dollars in education funds to states and localities annually using formulas that factor in uh, population and poverty levels. An accurate count is the critical first step to helping educators address the needs of every single child who walks in our classroom doors. And the count happens once every 10 years, and this is that 10th year. Um, so why is the census critical? Um, obviously, the data determines the distribution of more than $800 billion. We're talking uh, $120 million for Title I programs, school lunch programs, another $100 million, uh, school breakfast programs, $35 million. So obviously, that's money that our state needs. These are funds that help our schools reduce our class sizes, hire specialists, continually bolster teacher quality, and offer preschool to low-income uh, families and ensure hungry students can get breakfast or lunch to help them pay attention in class. Uh, when children and their families go undercounted, it's likely that their schools and communities will receive the will not receive the resources um, unless they're counted. Uh, so we're we're dealing with a lot of hard to count communities, such as uh, recent immigrants or English language learners, those without financial stability and stable housing. So there's a host of these groups out there, um, especially pertinent to education. Is the uh, children ages zero to five are sometimes undercounted, even in households where everyone else is counted accurately simply because the adult filling out the forms unaware that those babies and toddlers need to be included. Uh, so what can you do to help? And everybody as well behind me, um, talk to your family, talk to your coworkers and friends about what's at stake. There is a ton of resources. Uh, the NEA is gonna have materials for your classrooms, posters. The uh, Census Bureau actually has a great website with videos and a very uh, catchy song that you can play in your classrooms or wherever. Um, you know, check with the Census Bureau Statistics and Schools website. Um, we just ask that every student needs to be counted, and that's our jobs to make sure that happens. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you.